What's up, my beautiful friends? It's Eddie here. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for being here. Today I have another 90s Barbie unboxing and review video for you guys. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys enjoy these videos as much as I enjoy making them for you. Today we will be taking a look at this beautiful lady here. This is a very velvet Teresa Barbie doll from 1998. And she's such a cool and pretty doll. I'm very excited to show her to all of you guys. I recently purchased her on eBay. And this doll has a pretty cool concept. Uh, again, this is very velvet that Essa Barbie. And um, I'm sure most of you guys know, but in case somebody out there watching this doesn't know, Teresa is pretty much Barbie's Latina friend. So yeah, Teresa is pretty much a Latina Barbie. Um, and she has a really cool box that I will also be showing you guys a close up of. But this doll has a pretty cool concept. Um, she comes with like sticker sheets and markers um, that I'm sure are completely dried out by now. Uh, but she did come with sticker sheets and markers so that you can color in the stickers and then just place them all over her dress. So I'm sure that she was such a cool concept for kids that were buying her back in 1998. I will not be placing these stickers on her dress, but I still hope that you guys enjoy the review and the unboxing of this video. Here's a close up of Teresa's box. As you can see, there's our beautiful doll here and she has like this dark green backdrop color. And right here we have the three sticker sheets and on this side we have the three colored markers that you use to color in her stickers. And here in this corner, it has a picture of Teresa with her skirt and the stickers placed all over her. So you can see that's kind of like what the whole concept is. You color in the stickers and then you place them all over her dress. It actually looks really, really cool. I'm not going to lie. And then here it says, very velvet Teresa, friend of Barbie. And in the back of the box, we have a picture of all the other girls that were available in this line. This is such a beautiful photo that I definitely will be saving for my collection. As you guys know by now, I like to save the artwork or like the photos that come with my Barbie dolls or all of my dolls in general. So right here with pink letters, it says very velvet Teresa, friend of Barbie. Here's a picture with all the girls. And we have Teresa, the Latina, Christy, the AA. We have, of course, our traditional blonde Barbie there. And we have Kira down here. They all look super amazing. I would love to own all of these ladies one day and here on the side we have another artwork that showcases uh you coloring the stickers and then placing them all over the the, the doll's dress and yeah it, it looks like a lot of fun i'm sure that whoever bought her back in 1998 had lots of fun and i absolutely love this photograph down here it has all the four girls and they're posed so glamorously i love it this is just so 90s i love it so much you guys definitely will be saving this picture all right guys so with that being said let's go ahead and take this beautiful girl out of her packaging whoa lots of craziness going on back here once again here is Teresa in her packaging without the glare from the plastic she looks very elegant in her box here ah who doesn't love a bunch of 90s Barbie plastic and little Plastic twisty. Ooh, what is this? She comes with some instructions here that I think were meant to be colored in. That's pretty cool. It's like a little pamphlet here. If I can open it of like the instructions, but they come sort of like a coloring sheet. That's pretty cool. This is so nostalgic. This is so cute. She also came with like this tiny little pamphlet here that would showcase um, other Barbie products that were available. Ah, the memories. Now to deal with these annoying little plastic twisties i hate these things man i'm glad that barbie nowadays doesn't come with these <laughs> like most 90s barbies dolls she did come with her own little hairbrush this is a black one here and here is a close-up of our beautiful teresa barbie doll she is absolutely gorgeous man she's super super beautiful you guys she has like beautiful blue eyes and it's funny, Teresa always has like different eye color. Sometimes you'll get Teresa with brown eyes, sometimes you'll get Teresa with blue eyes. So it just kind of depends on the line. Um, one thing I was very surprised to see was that she came with crimped hair. Very 90s and very, very fun. I was just very surprised to see that, but it was a very pleasant surprise. I think it's a really cool um, hairstyle. As you can see, there is some blonde highlights in there, which is really, really nice actually. It's, it's unique and her bangs are also blonde, which is... It's super rare. I, I like it. I really like it. Um, she is wearing like these silver diamond earrings. 
and she has very minimum very minimal makeup um, she's wearing like some eyeshadow and a little light pink lipstick color and she's also wearing her little silver crown here which I was surprised to see that it's actually a fabric crown it's not plastic it's fabric and it even like has a button on the back to keep it in place um her hair tie did disintegrate at the top here she's supposed to kind of have like this updo hairstyle but that's okay I'll give her a new uh hair tie and here is her velvet outfit I know it's kind of hard to see because it's all black but she is wearing this really soft and high quality material of a velvet um sort of kind of like little jacket here and it does have some silver button details here and here is her big skirt that is removable it's like made out of glittery tool it's really really nice as you can see it has a lot of glitter going all over it it's actually really really nice and there's a big black bow here which helps you um with keeping it on and keeping it off of her and she is wearing some black pants underneath because she has a black jumpsuit underneath and even her even her boots are velvet you guys i was so surprised to see that i'm so sorry it's hard to see but yeah even her boots are velvet you guys it's so cool it almost looks like it's a one piece and it all comes together which i actually really appreciate i think it's very high fashion and it's something that you would totally see on the runway today so i'm gonna go ahead and remove the skirt and the jacket so you guys can see her jumpsuit underneath all right guys and we're back with barbie without her jacket and her big skirt and as you can see she's wearing this beautiful one piece velvet jumpsuit the boots are removable and underneath the boots she is wearing black stockings which is nice to see um yeah this outfit is just so beautiful i love her like this i do like her with the skirt and the jacket as well just because she looks very regal and very fancy but i think like this she just looks extremely high fashion and ready for the runway so i do love her like this i think for display though i will keep her with her skirt and her jacket on but I have to say I absolutely love her like this as well. Um, what was surprising to me was that her jumpsuit does not have buttons or Velcro. It's totally a one piece. So I'm sure removing it will be kind of annoying. But again, it's worth it because it's such a beautiful high fashion look in my opinion. She's just such a stunning Teresa doll, you guys. I absolutely love her. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I love her. And she does have the bend and snap knees. I don't know how well you guys can hear that. But she does have the bend and snap knees. And she does not have articulation on the elbows or the wrists or anything like that. But she's just such a beautiful doll, you guys. I absolutely love the con the concept of this doll overall. And I love her in her jumpsuit here. I think it's just so high fashion. Let me know what you guys think of it. And that's all I have for you guys today. Sorry this video was a little bit sloppy. I was fighting with the lighting throughout the entire video. So I was kind of rushing. But I hope you guys enjoyed it regardless. So let me know what you guys think of Very Velvet Teresa. Let me know what look to you guys like better. Do you like her better with the big skirt and the jacket on? Or if you prefer her with the one piece? Personally I love both. But I do absolutely love her in the one piece. My doll did get stained from wearing the black all those years, for all those years, I don't know how you guys can see it, but mine did get stained here on her little chest area, but that's okay. But I did want to let you guys know in case you saw that in the video. But yeah, you guys, she's such a fun and beautiful doll, and let me know what you guys think of her. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.